Hello. Ladies and gents, this is the moment you've waited for. Been searching in the dark, your sweat soaking through the floor. Buried in your bones, there's an ache that you can't ignore. Taking your breath, still your mind, and all that is real is left behind. Don't fight it, it's coming for you, running at you. It's only in this moment, don't care what comes after. It's a fever dream, can you feel it getting closer? Just surrender, cause you feel the feeling taking over. It's fire, it's freedom, it's blood and open. It's a preacher in the pulpit and you find devotion. There's something breaking at the brick of every wall you're holding, all that you know. Tell me, do you wanna go? When it's covered in all the colored lights, and the runaways are running the night, impossible comes true, taking over you. Oh, this is the greatest show. dark can't see one of you I'm really sorry <laughs> can I have a bit more sort of track through these monitors my son thank you so much well good are you excited 
What for? Vox Clever. I'm really excited. I, I, I just watched them in the, in the sound, check, uh, sound check a little earlier on and they sound amazing. So you're in for a treat tonight, you really, really are. But you've got to suffer me first for the first half an hour. Uh, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Lee Gilbert. I'm here just to show exactly how talented and good looking and wonderful these boys are. I'm just the antithesis <laughs> of all of that, basically. They thought they'd bring their granddad on stage just to uh, try and get that forward for you. Okay, so... Um, Tonight, I'm not under any pressure. Tonight's not my show. You haven't paid to come see me, so I'm just here going to do a couple of new songs for you. If that's okay, you're not going to get any swing or jazz or anything like that out of me tonight because uh, I'm changing my tack. I'm going to do some new songs. Is that okay with you? Yeah. Great, okay. And take a little drink. This next one, uh, do you like The Greatest Showman, by the way? Yeah. Good. I'm so glad you said that because I have got a new show coming out in August. <laughs> the Greatest Showman is going to go around the place. If you see it, please... Uh, buy a little ticket. But I really love the songs, I really love the writers. The writers of The Greatest Showman have written some great, great musicals. And one of their, uh, I think, best musicals is coming to London quite soon, at the end of this year. It's called Dear Evan Hansen. Have you, anybody heard of it? Yeah. Both of you, amazing. <laughs> okay, it's a great show, it's a wonderful show. I was lucky enough to see it on Broadway last year and it's amazing. It's about a young boy who's basically on the edge of society slightly. Um, but it's a, it's a really good feel, uh, good, feel good show for a, a younger generation. And I'm going to sing a song for you now. It's called Waving Through a Window. It's the opening song of that show. I hope you like it. Do it. 
very much. So they asked me to do this gig, and I thought, okay, so these are going to be all young and trendy, and I thought, I don't do stuff like that, you know, I don't do the young things. I'm, I listen to radio too, I don't know what's going on in the charts. So I've got to find one, I've got to find one. I thought, I really like this one, this young Scottish lad's been singing it. I thought, I'll Google it. Somebody you loved. I thought, oh, I love that song. I wonder if it's been released. Looked it up. It's been number one for seven weeks. Did I know that? I didn't know that. Did you know that? I didn't know that. So I thought, well, let's try this. And so I've got this little gadget here, by the way. This is, uh, it's very important. It's got an iPad. <laughs> it's got words on it. So if I look at it, right, you know, I've forgotten them. So, <laughs> first time I've ever sung this in public, so please bear with. Um, I love this song. It's called Somebody to Love. And it goes like this. were sort of like a bit a cappella and a bit not barbershop but you know they're very modern in what they do um with their harmonies i thought oh it'd be lovely to do something a bit acoustic with you and then i remembered i can't play guitar <laughs> or play piano so i thought okay i'll get a nice little uh, backing track for something i'm sure you'd know um so i went back to the the, the 70s really and i found a james taylor track any james taylor fans here yeah. yes both of you thank you so much i'm glad you came so through this one, I thought, we have a nice little acoustic feel to this. And if you want to join in and sing along, this is where we start to get in the mood for what's coming later on. So please feel free. Sing along, clap along, snap your feet. Just do it in time. <laughs> Goes like this. Oh, 
trouble and you need a helping hand and nothing oh nothing going right just close your eyes and think of me and soon I will be there to brighten you like that sort of thing? I don't do many show tunes anymore, but there's some really, really great shows at the moment in the West End and, and uh, on Broadway. <laughs> yes. There's a lot of them. <laughs> Have you got a favourite? Anyone. <laughs> I don't know that one. Anyway. Did any of you see the Britain's Got Talent final on Sunday? Yeah. There was a little Irish boy on there that sang this song and I thought, oh, that's amazing. This song is usually sung by a woman. It's, uh, it's the, the big song from a show called Waitress. It's in London, it's on Broadway. And uh, 
Lucy. The lads, Lucy's, exactly. Lucy Jones is going to take over the lead uh, pretty soon. She sang this in a concert we did the other night, and I thought, oh, this is a wonderful song. If only a man could sing it. And then this boy did it on Britain's Got Talent the other night, and I thought, damn, yes, I'm having that one. So I'm going to give it a go. I've never sung this before in public. If it all goes wrong, what the hell? Then it, what do you pay, a tenner? Nothing. <laughs> You've had eight quid risk already, haven't you? I don't know, let's be honest. <laughs> it's a lovely song. It's from Waitress, and it's about, um, there's a young, a young woman, she's working in a, in a, uh, a diner, a diner, and her life is, is not going great. She's, she's pregnant, she's married to a, an abusive husband, she's pregnant, she doesn't know what to do, her life's pretty shit. And uh, she sings this song, but don't, it all gets better, don't worry, but, you know. It takes another hour to do that, and I won't do it. <laughs> so go like this. It's not simple to see the most peace. I don't recognize me. Left these shoes in the same The place and its patrons have taken more than I gave. It's not easy to know I'm not anything like I used to be Although it's true I was never attention sweet singer I still remember that girl She's
Okay, so we've got a decision now. Do we go for another big song? Or do we go for something fast? Or something slow? What have we got, what have we got time-wise? What are we looking? <laughs> Judges at the back there. What have I got? Five minutes, ten minutes? Time's over. Ten! Ten! Oh my god, I'm gonna have songs. Okay. <laughs> I'll tell you what then. Do you like The Greatest Showman? Can you put that one back in, um, Sam? Sorry, you know the one I mean. So, again, I'm gonna do this uh, gender reversal thing because there's a, there's a fantastic song in that film that, you know, guys don't get to sing because the, in the film it's the one that the lady opera singer sings on the front of the stage with the spotlight. She doesn't move her arms like a puppet. But uh, I'm gonna try this one for you then. Seeing as we've got 10 minutes, we might as well. So this is a song called Never Enough. If you wanna join in, don't do that. It's too high, don't worry. There's one coming up you can join in with, we'll do that. Okay, so, Greatest Showman, never enough. Maestro, please. Never 